guys, it's Lizzie Lismar here from Nifty Little Things and I'm with MyDubaiMyCity.com who have asked me to show you one more DIY project and uh, today I'm going to be showing you how to make a clock out of magazines. It'll be so much fun. Let's get to it. Alright, so I'm going to start by telling you about where to get everything because um, that's what we are all about, telling you the easiest way to make this project. Now this is a staple gun. I purchased one in Ace Hardware, but um, you can find them pretty much in any little hardware store in Satwa or Deira. And this one is my trusty little screwdriver drill and it's, a, it's, pretty, um, it's pretty good. It's from Ikea, but um, it's worth for all the projects that I've done so far. Just some regular scissors. Um, this little mechanism, it's a watch mechanism and it comes with all the hands and this you can find in Satwa for about 25 dirhams but if you go into a uh, deep Deira you'll find it for five which is pretty good. Magazines, just go and get your favorite magazines, keep some and, uh, and use the old ones. Some scotch tape is going to help you along and what I've made here is a um, circular um, MDF board. It's pretty thin pretty easy to work with. You can find these at Creative Mind. Um, they have some pre-cut wood there. Um, if not, just Ace Hardware will also cut these for you. All right, so I'm gonna start and I'm gonna wanna pick out um, good colorful images. For instance, this has a lot of colors and this one. And you're not gonna see what they say or anything like that. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna start rolling the paper in a diagonal direction and just keep rolling, rolling, rolling. Keep it tight. Little cylinder here. Take a little piece of tape and just tape the end of your cylinder so you doesn't roll out. That's pretty good. And you're gonna do one that's long and one that's short. But because they're coming out this way, what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna cut them and then start placing them all around my clock. All right, so I've cut a few pieces already, but I'm sure we're gonna have to use some more in the, in the, uh, towards the end. But what I'm doing is I'm cutting them in, diff in different sizes and putting them just about there in the back. Because what we wanna do is we wanna leave space for this box here. So we don't wanna actually put any in the way. And I'm gonna use my staple gun and just staple there and there. There you go. Do you see that? We're going to do that all the way around. Okay, so we're almost there, halfway. I've stopped halfway because it's time to put in our hole to put in our um, watch device. Okay? So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to place a hole right in the center of our watch. Okay, so I've just made a little hole on my watch so that this can go through it and this is where our hands will go. But for now, we'll just put that to the side and continue rolling our magazines. All right, guys, so I've finished putting on the newspaper um, on the sides, and now I'm just gonna take a decorative pen, paint pen and put some stuff on the sides so that it looks even more nifty, okay? All right, so now I'm gonna show you how to put these little hour hands and second hands. Um, so just watch real close. So just make sure to push it all the way down until that white bit, it's, it's been between that white bit. The, um, the second hand has a, goes on this top bit there and you're just going to pop that in and make sure that that's there. And then the last uh, second hand is just popped in on the top like that. Ooh. Mm. There you go. Well, there you have it guys, our own vintage wall clock. Pretty neat, hey?
If you enjoyed the video, please share with your friends. And if you'd like to know more about our nifty little workshops where we do crazy crafts like these, um, find us on Facebook at Nifty Little Things or our website, niftylittlethings.ae, uh, for more dates and information. And uh, I'm Lizzie Lismar. Thank you for joining us. And thank you to My, du My Dubai My City for uh, allowing us to do this project with you. See you guys next time.